everyone, it's Big Z and welcome to Calendula. This is a game that I saw on Steam that looked very strange. Like, it looked like a very weird game. I believe the concept of the game is that you can't play the game. Instead, you solve puzzles to try to play the game, which is the actual game. It's very confusing, I know. But, like I said, it looked weird, but it also looked like a fun time, so I kind of wanted to try it out. And it started off with this screen, and I don't know if this is important or not, so I figured I'd include it. Uh, but my name is Big Z. So... Introduce your birth year. 1993. Enter the birth month. I don't like everyone knowing my birthday. I'm one of those weirdos who doesn't like to celebrate her birthday. Yeah, December. And introduce the day. 11th. But now they- thanks. Enjoy the game. Was that their way of like sneakily getting a survey done? <laughs> Is this game just gonna be taking a bunch of surveys? Oh, joyous day. Music is dramatic. Um, but now that you all know my birthday, whoa. I expect presents in bulk. I'm just kidding. Anyways, um, it is not your fault. Cool. I didn't know anything was wrong. I, I didn't know there was anything to fault. New game. Video error. The game is unable to start. Current video configuration is not supported. Load game. There are no files to load. Well, good. That's what I would expect. Okay. Um, I, that would probably be more concerning because I haven't played the game, so it would be more concerning if it had files to load. Um, so it said the video is not correct? I don't know. Brightness? I didn't do it! You said it wasn't my fault. That was not my fault. I didn't mean to do that. Did I break the game? Is that part of the game? I don't know. Like I said, this game is very strange, so keep an open mind. There is no way back. Well, I could just leave the game? There is no way back. What does that mean? New game? Cannot create a new game. Memory slots not available. What? Genesis. Okay. <laughs> um, is this the game? Watching it make a leaf pattern? Or a triangle thing? I don't know. Oh, hey, we're in the game. I guess. I mean, we were always in the game, but now we're like in a realish kind of game setting? I don't know. Did you guys have to go with this color for the walls out of curiosity? It makes it look like, I don't know. Makes it look like the walls are made out of meat. Okay, this is weird. This is very weird. But we're just gonna roll with it. You know, nothing to worry about. Also, I feel like I'm floating on air. Am, am I just like floating in the middle of the air? Okay, I am no longer in control. It is just doing a thing right now. Okay. I feel like there's a very deep meaning be behind like the visuals it's giving me right now, but I don't get it. I'm not doing any of this. Okay. I guess the game just knows what it, it wants to do, so I'm just gonna sit here and play along. Mostly because I don't have any other choice. What the heck is this game? This is weird. Invert your values? Okay, well my mouse is the same. I didn't know if it inverted my mouse. Okay, video. Oh, now it inverted my mouse. No, oh wait. It kind of did. Left and right are inverted, but up and down are the same. Ugh, I don't know how to feel about that. It's weird. It's weird. I don't like it. Video, uh, no, not video. It would be under controls, right? Controls. Invert control. Broke the game again. Is, is that also a part of the meta? You just break the game over and over again until it works? Did you, try, did you try turning the game on and then turning it off and turning it back on again? Soon you will understand my words. Okay. Good for you. Encoding error. Okay. Babel. 
Isn't that the name of the pig? This game is password protected. Please enter the password. Um, Big Z. December 11, 1993. God dang it. <laughs> Why'd you ask for my, my birthday then? Gosh dang it. Is there some sort of like graphic imagery that is 18 plus or something once we get into the game? I mean, we're already- I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. We're in the game, but we're not in the game. We're in the menu screen part of the game. Not the act- I don't know. This is the actual game. I don't know. Uh, you will soon understand my words, so... Okay. Are we supposed to do something with this? I can't tell what the heck is what anymore. How am I supposed to find my way around? That one. New game. Secret? There are secrets about? Okay, it won't let me go back. Secret. Cool. How do I- how do I go back? Why won't you let me go back? There we go. Uh... Uh ha ha ha. Okay, 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 no no no, I got this, I get it, I get it, I get it. Let me go back. Uh, hopefully I can figure out how to get back. Is it this one? No. I don't know what that is. This one. Then that one? There we go, okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. I'm a smart cookie, I get it, okay. Or at least that's what I'm gonna keep telling myself. No, wait, no. It was this one. Ow. Sorry. Where's my phone? Let me take a picture of this bad boy. Eh. Okay. Alright. I think that's the password. Because, like, that's the blocky lettering that they had in the other language. I don't know. Does it actually spell out a word, though? Or do I have to just... Trial and error. So, configuration, language... Weird blocky text. And then play this, this. Oh uh, yeah, I think it's just gonna take me a while to figure out the password, okay. Give me a second to match the shapes, I'll be right back. Hey, there we go, okay, that took a while. <laughs> it did spell something in case you guys were curious, it spelled secret, which makes sense because when you go to the new game in that language it says secret. So it was telling us the password all along, but I was too much of a stoop to figure that out. <laughs> so is this just like a weird place that we go to for like strange imagery or something since there's not an actual game? Since the game... Hello, eyeball. Okay. Nope, that's weird. That's where I draw the line. I'm perfectly okay with a really close up eyeball, but if you're gonna have it blink, that's creepy. I don't know, something about just having an isolated eyeball is perfectly fine to me, but if it's like someone's actual eye socket that you're like recording, that's weird. <laughs> I don't know. Stay calm, pay attention. Okay. There's something flashing on the screen. What does it say? This isn't gonna affect my recording, is it? I hope not. Sorry if this looks weird. It's saying leak. Now it's like really bad. Okay. Go back up. Also, why does it only go... Okay, it only goes up to 20. I was like, why was it set on 20? But it only goes to 20. So what am I supposed to do with leak? What are we leaking? There we go. Password was leak. Okay, that wasn't too hard. I don't know. This game is very interesting. I like the puzzles. They're challenging. They're definitely out of the box thinking, but I don't know. I'm not quite sure what to think of the rest of the game. Like, I feel like it's just being weird for the sake of being weird. Can I? I can't. Okay. There we go. I, I can't really control where I'm going. I can't go like left or right or backwards. I can only go forwards. But I guess the camera angle will just take care of all of that for us. Okay. 
Back- dang, game, back at it again with the weird visuals. Okay, game, what would you like me to do now? Who controls who? Good question. Very deep. Very philosophical, I guess. I don't know. And, uh, I am- I am a person, I think, therefore I am. Sophocles, something else. Load game. Let me guide you. This game- okay, I gotta find another password. I don't know if I'm gonna- memory slots, okay. Um, I was gonna try to, like, figure out the game all in one video, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get through the entire game. Because it's taking me a while to figure this stuff out. <laughs> um, but we'll keep going. We'll do a couple more. Video. What was the hint again? Like, the eyeball is like the little hint system. Who controls who? Configuration... Controls... Okay. Whoa! What are you doing? What are you doing, game? Am I- am I in control? Nope. I don't know what the game's doing. I don't know what's going on. This is like the end of Undertale, only way creepier. Are we good? Is everything back to normal? Do I have to do all that again? What do you want me to do in there? I don't know what it wants me to do. Like, I do that. Then we go up here. Can I- am I controlling this? No. So the game is controlling what's going on right now, but I don't know what it wants me to do. So, it was spelling... not you. Why'd I click on you? It was spelling I see you. So is that the password? Let me guide you. I see you? Password not valid. Okay. I see you. There we go. Okay. I wasn't sure whether or not to include spaces. This game is something else, man. Like when they were when they said that the game was a game that didn't want to be played, they were not kidding. Okay, we're back in here again. Back in this nightmare. Okay, yep. I really need to get you guys in, in contact with an interior decorator or something. Someone, you know, who can help you find something more appealing than meat walls and marble. I mean, I appreciate the alliteration and that, I guess. I don't know. But I feel like meat walls and marble are two things that don't usually go together. I also don't really get these visuals. I don't know if they're supposed to make you uneasy. Probably. They make me feel uneasy, so maybe that's the whole thing. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. This was Calendula. I was gonna try to play the entire game in one episode, but the puzzles are very challenging. It took me a while to figure out what to do. Like, the eyeball gives you hints, like, you know, it tells you where to go, like, it tells you when to go to controls, when to go to audio, when to go to video, stuff like that, but the actual puzzles take a hot second to figure out, which is nice, I don't know. I like the concept, it's a very interesting concept to have the entire game take place in the menu screen, I don't know. The visuals are very unsettling, I feel like that's the whole point of the game, it's supposed to, like, make you a bit on edge, it's supposed to make you feel uncomfortable. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It, it seems very experimental, so I like it. It's very weird. Like I said, if you like weird games that kind of set you on edge a bit and they have interesting puzzles, then this is your game. Um, but either way, I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode here. If you guys want to play the game, I will leave a link in the description. And yeah, overall, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. So I do want to thank you all for watching, and I will see you in our next little adventure. Bye!